decided to work with the literacy program because I love to read. And I thought it would be a wonderful thing to be able to share that with someone else and encourage them to love to read also. There are some seniors and uh, adults that uh, haven't finished school and now they would like to learn how to read and write and I felt that I could be a tutor for them. I had a, a mother-in-law who was illiterate and an uncle who was illiterate and I got a very good impression as what it is like to be so closed off from what's going on in the, in the world and in your own world. And so I don't want anyone else <laughs> to be in that position. When I found out about the program, I jumped all over. I love the literacy program because I love reading and I love people and I think everybody should be able to read. We have a great program, we have wonderful resources, but the most important part are the tutors. So the one-on-one -on -one part helps the students learn, they get specific instruction to help them achieve their individual personal goals. That day would be beautiful. I want to um, better myself as a person and um, learn how to read and write so I can you know, feel like an adult. I'm like 36 and I've never felt like an adult. I've always had someone helping me with everything. I would like to learn because my kids, they are in a school and they need my help. And I need a conversation with the teachers, doctors. I want to learn how to read better so other people don't read me stories. I want to read the stories. Each student is able to set their own goals. So we don't have a one size fits all. We don't have a one workbook as mandatory style of teaching. We have students who are very specific with us. They say, I want to understand what shows up in my mailbox. I don't know if it's junk mail. I don't know if it's from the government. I don't know if it's a bill I'm supposed to pay. I want to be able to fill out a job application. I want to be able to read the newspaper. I want to be able to register and vote. I want to understand what's on the ballot. I want to be able to show my boss that I deserve more pay, better working conditions, better hours, a promotion where I can supervise or be in charge. I started working with the program approximately four years ago, and the entire time I've had the same student. I've watched her not only learn to read, write, and speak English just so much better, but I've watched her become a, a more confident woman. She's able to deal with education professionals, the teachers of her daughters. She's able to deal with medical professionals. She filed a court case when that was necessary to do so. She got her driver's license. Well, the favorite part is actually seeing my student progress. <laughs> my favorite part is when I use the laptop. Help me a lot. I use in uh, different programs. And now I connect it with uh, Facebook and I see my family, my nephews and cousin and say, wow. The light goes on in somebody's face when they learn an expression or they learn the English. And English is a very difficult language to learn. There's so many big words, like um, words that end with shun or ing. Like, stuff like that, you know? It was like, I thought I would never be able to get, like, I'd walk up to one of my relatives, like, what does this say? What does that say? And I would basically get them to read it. And now I could read some things. There's some things I still have problems with. And I learn it. I sound out the letters. And um, that's basically it. It's like, oh, it's so easy. The first time when I read it, I don't understand. But I try and try and try. And one day he surprised with me because I read him and I am very interesting. And, and it's like a midnight and I am reading and my husband say, what happened? And say, it's because it's interesting, this book. One interesting thing that I didn't count on was the cultural experience. I uh, tutored a man from Burma I'm t tutoring right now a uh, PhD in engineering from Iran. 
My favorite part of the program is seeing my student. We have a wonderful time every week. And a pentathlon is just five events. Oh, five. Mm -hmm. It enriches my life very much to meet with her and to know someone and share her life, uh, especially because she's from a different culture. Jean Thorpe was an American Indian. He became one of the greatest. I'm really fortunate with Linda because she makes my life happy and, and everything because she's changing, she's changing my life and my kids' lives. I see their faces when I read the books to them and they understand when I try to explain the words. They feel really happy and they feel confidence when they are in a school or in other areas when, they, when the people speak English. When I stay in this program, I come in looking for a teacher, but I find a friend. I just like the whole atmosphere around here, and it's like a really great place to help people learn. I think literacy is the doorway to a better life. And it gives you that power to be something completely different. Like, you can evolve into the person that you want to be. I am happy in this program. It's a good deal. <laughs>